Hey guys, Technometry here today with the exciting video for you guys. So I'm going to be unboxing and reviewing a really cheap Samsung Galaxy S8 that I bought from eBay. So I bought three of them under $150 or each. I believe right now you can get them even cheaper than that. Check out the link that I included to the discounted Galaxy S8 that you can find on eBay. Really good deal going on right now if you're looking to buy even any other Samsung phones. They have really good deals. So I'm going to unbox to show you guys what condition the phone is and everything. So I ordered this phone a couple of days ago and it just came here today and also if you guys are new to our channel we do a lot of tech reviews and news and giveaways as well so make sure to hit that like and subscribe but it also we are gonna give away one of this phone to a lucky subscriber simply subscribe to our channel and then share this video on one of your social media such as facebook twitter instagram or whatever you have and then comment below that you have done that so let's go ahead and open this box up right now it is a little busted so we'll see if that did have any impact on the package itself so as you see i'm gonna go ahead and try to open it up from the back here so that it's easy for us to do that. Uh, the front has a label. I don't want to take, mess with the label. So let's go ahead and do that right now. So as you can see, I'm just using a scissor to cut the cardboard box. Okay, so let's take a look at the content. As you see, I did order three of them. So I have one here, two, and then the third one here. I'm going to put the box aside and i think they include oh look at this so this is really this is exciting this they actually included three different uh, i believe stylus for this one which is a bonus because that didn't say that on the listing so that's really cool that they the seller actually included that and so i'll put the box aside so a couple of tips i wanted to share with you guys whenever you're buying from ebay before we unbox this is that Whenever you're buying from eBay, make sure, you know, the seller you're buying from has lots of feedback, right? You want the feedback to be 95% or higher positive feedback. The next thing you want to check is the seller offers at least a 30-day return policy so that if there's any issues with these phones, I can simply return them within 30 days. Next thing you want to check is the condition of it. Most phones that are on good deals are going to be use seller refurbish manufacturer refurbish or pre-owned or even open box and then you also have your new ones of course so those are the conditions you want to check for i usually buy those condition ones i don't buy four parts you'll see a lot of four parts one that are broken phones and i don't fix phones so and most likely you don't either so you're not gonna you're gonna want to stay away from that next thing i check is that the listing has a lot of units that has been sold so this one as you can see i was able to buy three because the seller is selling a lot of them a lot of the listings will list how many has been sold so far so buy from a listing that already has lots that has been sold because that seller most likely has an inventory of them finally what you want to do is thoroughly read the listing what you want to look for is that the phone is fully functional most sellers will tell you that it's fully functional if they have an issue they'll tell you so only buy from fully functional phones and then the last thing when you're buying phone is that you want to make sure it's compatible with your carrier, right? So these phones are unlocked phones, so I can use it on any carrier. But there's phones that are specifically for T-Mobile, AT&T, or even Sprint or Verizon. You can only use those phones on those carriers and their sub-carriers. So read that. And if you have a question, simply you know, contact the seller and let them know, hey, does this phone work on this carrier? And usually they'll reply back to that kind of stuff. So sellers are pretty interactive. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get this um, unboxing and review video started for you guys. As you saw, these are the three stylists that I got as, I guess, free gift that this seller offered, which, you know, is pretty cool or nice of the seller but usually you don't get that so that's the first time i've seen some seller actually doing that so let's go ahead and open up one of the boxes here so first one i'm going to go ahead and open up so this one came so as you see these came in these nice little boxes so this is a sa as you can see here 
So this is that's eight here. Um, the first one, and then in the box here is included the charger. Also, read the listing when you're buying to make sure sometimes sellers don't include the charger. So this one, you know, as you see the charger is here as well. So we're gonna go ahead um, take a look at the review. So the back looks fine as you see the top and the sides are look good. The, the, these I believe were in use either use or seller refurbished condition. I don't quite remember, but they they're not new. But you know that's expected. So let's go ahead and power this one on. So this one is powering on. So I'm gonna move on to the next one. So this is this one of them. Let's move on to the next one. Okay, so the next one here, I'm gonna go ahead and power it on. As you see, it's the S8 here. Uh, the back looks good. Uh, very slight stuff that's not even noticeable on the camera, like slight scrubs here and there, but I don't, it's hard to really tell. I'm trying to zoom in to show you guys, but I don't think you know it really matters. So this one, as you see, is powering on. The back looks good. The front looks good as well there's a plastic sticker on top which we can go ahead and actually take that off so that's good as well um so you'll notice with this one here let's put this phone down this one you'll notice there's also a sim ejector for i think the other one added too so you can put your sim card in and if we open up further let's see if i can do that actually again this one has the charger in there as well so this one's good to go so we're gonna put this one side as well up here. Let's put this one here and then this one here. And then let's take a look at the last one here we have. And then the last one we have, here we go. We have this one as you see right here. Looks good. Um, and then let's go ahead and power it on. So it's powering on right now as well. The body condition looks fine. You know, they're not, you know, they, they are used phones. So there's like little minor stuff, but it's still a good phone. So we're going to go ahead and power that one on. Same thing with this one. As you see, there's a same ejector tool and then the power cable as well. So these phones are fully functional. So I don't have to worry about any issues with it. Usually when you buy a used phone, that's the one thing you're concerned with is that if they have any issues, but these, the seller already do, already does all the testing for you. So you're, you're guaranteed that there's no issue with it. So here, as you can see, I'm gonna go try to skip through the setup process. And so you can get to the home screen for you, or the main screen for you guys, so you guys can see. One thing I noticed about S, um, the Samsung phone is some of them have screen burn. So that's something you want to also look for is that the phone doesn't have some sort of screen burn because for some reason the Galaxy phones are known to have that. So that's a condition you want to avoid if you don't want to get that condition. As you see this one, we were able to get to the home screen. No issue here. The apps there you go the apps are looking like they're fine we are gonna go ahead and test the camera to show you guys the cameras working on this phone as you see right now i'm gonna go ahead and turn on the front facing camera same thing as well the front facing camera as you see it's working fine so let's move on let's check out the buttons here the ringer button as you see is functional the Bixby, I think it's functional as well. I'm not connected to the internet. And then the power button works as well. So that, so everything looks good. Um, I, I mean, you can test as much as you want, but because the seller is guaranteeing a fully functional phone, I don't have to worry about any of that because they have tools to kind of go and check that for you. So hopefully this video was helpful. If this video is helpful, please make sure to hit the thumbs up button on this video and also subscribe so that you can see other giveaways that we announced and reviews of other cheap phones that we're going to be doing like some of the s10 
tens and even the note series from the samsung and there are other android phone as well i also do reviews on iphones as well if you guys want to check those video out check them out in our channel and to enter the giveaway simply share the video on one of your social media so thanks for watching guys